Justin Welby failed to convince William and Harry to end differences on King's request. If you are just joining us for the first time, please do not forget to hit subscription button and turn on the notification bell below for more updates. Thank you. King Charles has asked Justin Welby, the Archbishop of Canterbury, to negotiate a deal between his sons to attend the coronation, after Prince Harry published his book Spare. While Harry was reluctant to face his family in Britain after all sorts of allegations, Prince William was unwilling to let him attend his coronation. British media reported that the Prince of Wales feared his younger brother would distract from the coronation. Although it has not yet been confirmed whether Justin Welby played a role in persuading Harry to attend the ceremony, Sunday The Sun reported that Harry had a candid conversation with his father, before agreeing to attend the coronation. Citing sources, the newspaper said they had spoken, and there was a willingness and willingness to make amends on both sides, following Harry's explosive revelations in his book Spare and the Netflix series. This will be Harry's first time with his family, since his six-part memoir and documentary series shocked the royal family. A report in The Sun on Sunday said the Duke of Sussex ended months without contact with Charles to discuss an invitation, but did not speak to William. The report did not mention whether the Archbishop of Canterbury spoke to Harry and William to end their arguments. There were also claims of corresponding with Buckingham Palace before Harry agreed, but there were no significant talks other than the couple's safety at Westminster Abbey. Citing insiders, the reporter told the publication the monarch was happy with his son's decision, and understands that Meghan will be with Princess Lilibet and Prince Archie. Sources say that Harry wanted to show support for his father by attending the coronation. Prince Harry must be forced to face everything he has given up on his coronation day, and see the future literally pass him by. In the commentator and royal expert Daniela Elser made these claims. According to the New Zealand Herald, Ms. Elser believes. However, surviving the two-hour coronation alone will not be the end of a difficult emotional journey for Harry. After the service, the King and Queen will return to Buckingham Palace, and be joined by a last group be followed by 15, which represents the heartbeat and future of the family. Come up with ideas for the podcast, nothing to do yet, he'll soon be forced to face whatever he's without. But here's the bright side. At least it'll give him something exciting to write about in his next book.